congratulations on your purchase of a Biosonic Ultrasonic Cleaner. In this video, we'll explain the operation basics you need to know in order to use your new cleaner. Solution The Biosonic UC150 Ultrasonic Cleaner is intended for cleaning medical instruments by the emission of high-frequency sound waves through a solution. The purpose of the solution is to break the bonds between the instruments and the soil. Water alone has no cleaning properties and has high surface tension, which inhibits the cavitation bubbles from developing. Adding cleaning solution reduces fluid surface tension and contains ingredients designed to optimize the ultrasonic cleaning process. There are three main types of solution for ultrasonic cleaning. Liquid solution allows for instantaneous solution prep, while tablets and powder solutions must be fully dissolved prior to cleaning. Note that some cleaning solutions work better on some contaminants, but not as well on other contaminants. It's recommended that biosonic solutions be used with your biosonic cleaner for consistent and effective performance. Temperature setting. The temperature of the solution can have an impact on the length and effectiveness of the cleaning cycle. To set the desired temperature on your cleaner, press the temperature button and choose a temperature between 70 degrees Fahrenheit to 140 degrees Fahrenheit. Select Heater On to activate heating function. A thermometer symbol will be displayed at the top of the main screen if the heater is selected on. Degassing Degassing is a process that eliminates large air bubbles in a solution that interfere with the cleaning process. Before cavitation can become effective in an ultrasonic cleaner, gas trapped in the liquid must be removed. If it's not removed, the cavitation bubbles will fill with this gas, cushioning the implosion force. Degassing is necessary each time a new solution is added to the tank. Your biosonic unit is equipped with a degas cycle that prepares your solution for use. Simply press the degas icon on the main screen, select Solution Type, and press the degas icon to start the degassing process. Testing In order to test that your ultrasonic cleaning unit is functioning properly, you'll need to perform intermittent foil tests. To perform a foil test, you'll need your Biosonic UC150, Foil Test Kit FT1, and any Biosonic solution or other solution. If you do not have the FT1 test kit, you can use three strips of regular weight aluminum foil. First, prepare a fresh tank of cleaning solution according to manufacturer's directions. Run the unit for five minutes to degas the solution. Then, using three rods, suspend three pieces of foil in the solution, making sure the edge of the foil does not come in contact with the bottom or sides of the tank. Run the unit for a five-minute cycle. Then, lift the foil out of the solution. An ultrasonic cleaner that is working properly will leave a pitted or wrinkled pattern in the foil. Holes should be observed in one or more of the aluminum foil pieces. Date the foil and keep it as a reference for the next time this test is performed. Setting cleaning cycles. Four cleaning modes are available to choose from on the main screen. Three of the modes are preset. Eco for light load time, regular for medium load time, and strong for heavy load time. My mode is for customized operation. Select the mode for your cycle by pressing the appropriate icon for your load. Ensure that the lid is closed before and during operation. Press the arrow button to start cleaning cycle. Press the pause icon to pause at any time. Once the timer reaches zero, Program Successful will be displayed on the screen until any button is pressed. Baskets To clean instruments in a basket, place the basket directly into the main tank containing Biosonic General Purpose, Germicidal, or Enzymatic Cleaner. Follow dosage instructions per cleaning solution label. After cleaning, rinse the basket and instruments thoroughly under running water. Load size. 
The larger the load of instruments placed into an ultrasonic bath, the less effective the cleaning cycle will be. Placing instruments in the basket so they overlap is not recommended, as open surface areas will be easier to clean. Changing the solution. Changing your solution every eight hours at a minimum is recommended, or whenever the solution becomes visibly soiled or dirty. How often the solution bath is changed can depend on the solution used, frequency of use, and size of cleaning loads. Draining and cleaning. Draining and drying the tank at the end of each workday is recommended. Drain your unit by fully rotating the drain handle clockwise to the open position and allowing the solution to empty into the sink or waste system. Rinse the tank, then fully rotate the drain handle counterclockwise to the closed position. Never drain the tank by manually discarding solution as this may cause the unit to stop working properly. All components should be cleaned daily by wiping with a soft cloth moistened with a commercially available mineral deposit remover followed by cleaning with isopropyl alcohol or a mild disinfectant. To clean the stainless steel tank, wash with a clean cloth, warm water, and mild soap or liquid dish detergent. Always clean in the direction of the original polish lines and rinse with clean water two to three times. Wipe dry completely. When cleaning, avoid letting dirt accumulate, using steel or stainless steel wool or scrapers to remove stubborn debris using harsh, abrasive, or bleach cleaners, using chemicals harmful to stainless steel, including products that contain chloride, fluoride, iodide, or bromide. Follow these steps every time you operate your Biosonic UC150 to ensure a successful cleaning cycle. For more information on your UC150, consult your instructions for use or visit coolteam.com.